Version 4.4 is coming to an end, with version 4.5 set to launch on March 13th. There's not much else to look forward to beyond the banners. Let's dive into what we can expect from 4.5, including the breakdown of all the ways you can earn Primo gems in the upcoming update. Upon the release of version 4.5, all players will receive 600 Primo gems through the in-game mail, as compensation from Hoyo. Following that, daily commissions will be available throughout the 42-day update period. A festival in Mondstadt will be the main event. There will be three mini-events, each offering 420 Primo gems. Completing Chiori's story quest will earn us an additional 60 Primo gems. With the banners for Chiori, Ido, Kazuha, and Nuvalet, there will be four limited banners and test runs with 80 Primo gems. The new Chronicle banner will feature Albedo, Eula, and Klee, also available for test runs, potentially adding another 60 Primo gems. The Spiral Abyss will reset three times during the version 4.5 update, offering a maximum of 1,800 Primo gems to those who can clear it with 36 stars each time. Heyman's Shop will reset once, providing five intertwined and five acquaint fates. Additionally, viewers of the version 4.6 special program will receive three redeem codes worth 300 Primo gems. Hoyo will likely release web events worth around 200 to 300 Primo gems, providing an opportunity for some extra Primo gems. Do remember that these figures are estimates, and actual amounts may vary slightly. Still, it's clear that version 4.5 lacks significant content. The Primo gem count falls short compared to the current patch. Thanks for watching. Will you be pulling in the new Chronicle banner?